hydroxyapatite, it's a naturally occurring mineral. Our teeth are made of it. So people are really into this idea that it's biomimetic. It's like a healthier alternative, alternative than fluoride. They have like an amazing marketing campaign behind hydroxyapatite. Yeah. There are a lot of toothpaste companies that take this and run with it, especially when fluoride is getting demonized in the news. It just helps bolster sales, those types it's of things. It's got really good PR. It has great PR. Like find <laughs> me the agent who's working for hydroxyapatite. I need to know. Right. We should all hire the them. Thing with, yes, there are a couple of issues with hydroxyapatite. The first is that we really don't have lo good long-term data on it. Mm -hmm. So to compare that against fluoride, which we have robust data that it's helpful in preventing cavities in two ways, both topically and systemically, we know that hydroxyapatite isn't on par with it at all. The way that hydroxyapatite works, it acts as a tubule occluder. So it basically plugs holes in the hydroxyapatite chain on the teeth and it can help in sensitivity, but does nothing for remineralization. And when it comes to the mouth, we're constantly talking about remineralizing and fighting the acid in our mouth, because that's how cavities form from the acid. So though hydroxyapatite may be a good complement, may be great for sensitivity, for cavity prevention, we don't know enough. We also don't know long-term the effects of you know, how it's eliminated from the body, et cetera, et cetera. Not to scare, again, the data, we just right. don't know yet. I think we'll get better in the future. Um, so I, I would be wary about what these companies are trying to sell you and also know that fluoride is extensively backed by public health, right. even for young children, as early as six months, as soon as that first tooth comes in, you want to introduce fluoride toothpaste. And if you don't have access to naturally occurring fluoride, you may be um, prescribed fluoride supplementation too.